In this video, I'm going to show you how to do the quick unboxing and a quick setup of your Epson Expression Photo XP8700 printer. So this is a very good printer for home or office use and I'll show you the complete setup. So let's open the box. Switch on the printer, go to the printer screen, on the printer screen select the language. We can start the setup using a smartphone or we can do it without the app. So we can just start from the printer. Next thing is to install the ink cartridges. Now this printer comes with the set of ink cartridges with a set of 6 ink cartridges the ink cartridge chamber door so push it up from here now take the ink cartridges out of the plastic packaging so there is a place to tear it now we will start installing the ink cartridges here now the first thing is to remove the seal so that's the seal here so just push it up and it will take away now make sure you match the color and the alphabets accordingly and place the ink cartridge facing like this here the ink cartridge here facing the chip down the back side will go first and then the front and you hear a lock sound that means it is installed properly Now close the ink cartridge chamber door by just pressing it little bit down. Go to the screen. So once we install the ink cartridges, click on the installed button. Wait for the ink system to start. It will take around 10 minutes. So just follow the alignment. Just check whatever the correct is. Just enter the details there now we have to select the square with the fused streaks and that's here as you can see here we have to check the squares and this is our page from where we have to select so that's the hash 1 to hash 7 so let's start with the hash 1 so that's number 5 so you just have to select whatever is clear now click on the print again because it will print few times different kind of patterns so that the print quality is really good after that click proceed now it says print head alignment is complete you can adjust again from the maintenance that's okay now we can see our main screen and our printer is ready for the copy function so we have done the initial setup so i'll show you how to connect it with the wi-fi so go to the main screen and click on the Wi-Fi button on the top. Here you can see Wi-Fi Direct and Wi-Fi Recommended. Now Wi-Fi Direct is when you don't have any home or office Wi-Fi network. So today I'm going to use the Wi-Fi that is recommended. So select it. Start setup. Now click on the Wi-Fi Setup Wizard. Wi-Fi Wi-Fi Setup Wizard, it will search for your home Wi-Fi network or if it's a business then it will search for the business Wi-Fi network in the range. Now you have to scroll down and select your Wi-Fi network. Select it and click on the Start Setup. So enter the password of your Wi-Fi 
So you enter the password, click on the start setup. So it will connect to the wireless router. Setup is complete. Now click on the home button. Next thing is to add this printer in any device for starting printing and scanning. For example, I am going to use it with my iPhone. Now go to your Epson iPrint app. Click OK. Agree with the app terms and conditions. Here we have to add the printer. So just select here. Again select here. It should display XP8700 series. Select it. It will ask you to use Epson Smart Panel or keep using Epson iPrint. So keep using Epson iPrint. Instantly it will show up the details of your printer, estimated level of ink and if you go to the home button, your printer should be available here and it says printer is ready. So now I am going to show you a quick test. For example, I am going to show you scanning. So open the top scanner lid and place a page for scanning. So here I have a page facing downwards here. Now close the lid. Now go to your app and click on the scan button and click on the scan. So here we can see the scan has arrived and it's a really good quality scan. So this way we can do the quick setup of this printer and unboxing and thanks for watching.